What's going on guys? E here, welcome some more Star Wars Commander. Today guys, I'm back with another uh, part to my little series that I've been doing on speculating about my dream Battlefront 3 game and what I would want to see if there ever was a Battlefront 3. If EA would ever make a Battlefront 3, this is what I would want to see in the game. So last week I did a planets video, what, I, what planets and maps I would want to see in a Battlefront 3. And today guys, I'm going to be doing for part 2 what game modes I would like to see in this game compared to the first two games. So so before we get into the video, make sure to go down below, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications so you don't miss a future Star Wars video. Let's jump straight into this, guys. So starting off with some of the smaller game modes, I think we should have this, the classic team deathmatch as always. You can't go on with a team deathmatch. I think also heroes vs. villains as well. Keep heroes vs. villains the same as you did. It's the same as in Battlefront 2. Keep it kind of like the team deathmatch format with just with heroes. Then also another small game mode I feel like we should have is actually sort of like a dual game mode where pretty much you're, you're just using lightsabers. You're just Jedi and Sith fighting each other 1v1. Not heroes of villains or anything like that. Just just 1v1 pure lightsaber combat. No blaster heroes. Just two people fighting and dueling it out on smaller maps. Now these are really the only small scale maps I, or game modes I should say uh, that I think should be in the game. I don't feel like there should be too many game modes in Battlefront 3 to, just to keep the player base more condensed in one section of the game. I actually thought, forgot to mention the player count that I think should be in this game as well. So moving the player count up from 40 players up to a max of 64 players for the big large scale game mode just kind of like Battlefield is so I feel like with the next generation consoles if there ever was a Battlefront 3 I feel like they should move the player count up to 64 players so 32 v 32 and then the medium scale would be 32 so actually moving on to the medium scale game modes I feel like these medium scale game modes should be 32 players and I feel like it should either be strike or extraction type of thing like if you develop and improve extraction and strike and move it into something new and good and better than what it was in Battlefront 2 and with 32 players I feel like it could be actually a pretty cool type of game mode and then also I feel like hunt a, a new hunt mode would be really cool not just Ewok hunt but like Wampa hunt, Gungan hunt, Genosian hunt just improve and evolve Ewok hunt into different hunts and just make it bigger maybe like a 20 player uh, hunt game mode or something like that. Moving on to the large scale game modes which would hold 64 players we would have the standard conquest as always like, just like Battlefront 2 had, but just without the, the capital ship phase, so you can just do everything. I feel like the map should be a bit bigger than what they would in Battlefront 2, maybe add a couple more command posts, and yeah, that's pretty much all you have to do for the standard conquest. It's just standard conquest, make bigger maps, more command posts, there you go. And then also, I feel like they should have a new space mode as well, a new starfighter mode, which should be more like battle the original Battlefront 2 from 2005. I feel like it should be more like that, where you can board enemy capital ships, destroy enemy ships, and do all that dogfight if you want, board them, destroy them from the inside. I feel, I feel like it should be more like that, and it, you pretty much win by getting a certain amount of points. The first team to get a certain amount of points or tickets would win that match. Now for the more large-scale linear game mode, which would be like the attack and defend like Galactic Assault in Battlefront 2, but I feel like it should be less like Galactic Assault and more like co-op in Battlefront 2 or even like Battlefield 1 operations where one team's attacking two different command posts have to capture those command posts to progress to the next sector and the other team that def is trying to defend from capturing those different command posts. So you progress through, through, through different sectors after ca capturing different command posts and just progressing through the map but it and you also have certain amount of tickets for the team that is attacking so if the defenders the, if the defenders uh, kill a certain amount of your teammates uh, you will lose that round but also you will have reinforcements to come back in and try again you will have multiple tries or maybe like around three tries just kind of like battlefield one operations and if you do fail you of course you get another chance but you also be reinforced with a vehicle kind of like in Battlefield 1. So you, you, the, if the Republic is attacking and they fail, they will get reinforced with maybe an ATTE or maybe a turbo tank. If it was like Empire attacking, they would be reinforced with an AT-AT. 
maybe with the droids, it'd be like a spider droid or like a, one of those big spider droids like on Christophus, Christophus, something like that. I can't really remember the name. I'll put a picture up on screen, but they, they will be reinforced with a certain vehicle. So I feel like this would be a really cool type of thing. And then if you do actually progress to the next sector, somebody will be chosen to be able to be a hero and play with a hero. And then reinforcements will kind of work the same way as, a, as they did in the recent Battlefront 2, where you have to get a certain amount of points to get those reinforcements. So as you progress more through the map, there will be more heroes, vehicles, and reinforcements to just have an all-out big battle. Also, vehicles will spawn randomly on the map, so you won't have to pay for vehicles with battle points. They will just spawn randomly, and you can jump in them at any point in time, like the original Battlefront 2. Now, moving on to the final game mode, which will be the main game mode for Battlefront 3, is the big ground to space game mode, which will combine the regular conquest and the regular space slash starfighter game mode that we talked about a bit earlier. So you have a certain amount of tickets that you need to get to, so you. So when both teams will try, will try to get a certain amount of points to win the game. You can do that by capturing different command posts or flying up to space with a starfighter and destroying different enemy command posts, boarding them, destroying from the inside, taking an escape pod, and then going back down to the ground to join that combat or start in space, get in a starfighter from one of the capital ships or maybe even just defend a capital ship and fly, do some dogfighting, or fly back down to the battle that's on the ground and join that fun combat. You will get different heroes, vehicles, reinforcements, and all that like you would normally do in a Battlefront game. So these are pretty much the game modes that I would love to see in a Battlefront 3 if there ever was one. I didn't go into too much detail about these game modes, I probably could, but I just kind of wanted to get this video out as always. But let me know what you, game modes that you guys would like to see in a Battlefront 3 if there ever was one. So let me know in the comments down below. Anyways guys, hope you have all enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye.